students need to be moved through those levels of development of understanding um, from the very basic level that the world is black and white and there are correct answers to everything to that more sophisticated understanding that there are always leeways of choice. What is it that I'm actually doing with the essays that I talked to you about the essay project and bringing the formative feedback on a summative assessment back in time, moving it earlier in the course so that the students could use it. What I've done is that I've given the students the opportunity to put in a draft of their essay a few weeks before it's due and that I will provide them with comments on it. So they'll be the same sort of comments that I would put on the essay if they'd handed it in at the end. But they have a chance to incorporate that feedback if they want to, to redraft their essay if they want to, and in particular I want them to look at restructuring their essay. So in Moodle what you're able to do is post up, we've posted up here a separate section which is about the essay, and there are various steps that students can post. They can all see everything everyone else has posted, they will all be able to see the comments that I have posted. So my students will benefit from being able to look at someone else's essay and my comments on it. And we all know it's so much easier to find the mistakes in someone else's work. So I think they'll find it pretty easy to say, oh yeah, Charlotte says that this doesn't quite work and I think I agree with that. And hopefully they, they, that means that 25 essays, 25 lots of feedback can be extended across all 25 of them instead of it just being a one-on-one -on -one issue.